In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to exclude a segment on MailChimp. So the first thing that you would like to do, of course, is just go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually using Brave, but of course, in your case, you can use any other browser it could be possibly working for you. Once you open that browser, make sure to go to this URL section and simply type mailchimp.com and hit the enter button. And that should take you into this page, which is going to be your home screen or your main screen. Of course, if you have an account, you can simply go and click at login into your account so you can actually enter your name or user's name or email, then password, then you can log in into your account. If you don't have an account, you can actually scroll down here and see all the plans that they have. They have the three paid plans and one free plan. Once you choose whatever plan suits you, let's use this as an example, they're going to get you to the section where you can actually create your account. As you can see, let's just click add to this free plan, sign up for free or sign up free, and that should take you here. Simply just enter your email, username and password, then click on sign up. Let me do that and I'm coming back. So now you have to check your email by just going to your email and activate it by the message that they're gonna send you. Once you activated your account, you'll find yourself here again. So let's just click at continue free. Here, you'll have just to enter your first name, last name. So let's just enter those that is uh, like suggested for me and click on next. Of course, the phone number is just optional. And here, of course, you'll have to enter your address, thanks and etc. So let's just enter those, click on next. And here, of course, you'll have to answer some questions. If you don't want to, it's cool. You can just keep pressing, pressing and at next, as you can see. But the first one, you should actually just answer it. And you will see the rest of them, you can actually cl keep clicking at skip. Once you finish, click on finish. And as you can see, once you click on let's go, you will find yourself on the home screen of the MailChimp websites. As you said in the beginning of this tutorial, uh, we would like to exclude the segment. So of course, if you want to do that, we can simply go to create your campaign. Uh, let's just click on campaign. Here's an example. Click on this regular email to choose something, uh, a content for our email. Of course, that's, we will not care about that. Let's just choose something right here and right away click on continue. As I said, we are not Okay, so we have to change something, I guess. So no, okay, it's worked. So here on this two, you will have to click on add recipients in here and on the audience, you will have to choose the tags that you want to receive the, the email or your company. If you want to exclude the segment, simply don't choose it right here. For me, I have just this tag or this option. So if I click on it, as you can see here in this segment or tag, they are giving me all subscribers and audience group on new, or new segments or new subscribers and etc. So for you, just on this audience, don't add the segments that you would like to receive your email and uh, they will be excluded. So that's actually for the tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching. Goodbye.